Right, I'm just going to start as usual with the large hike and some clear water all the way over. Nice and even. So that way even with this cheap cheap paper you can you can still make some nice paintings on it without all the cockling and what have you that goes with it. Raw sienna. In fact I'll just give the uh, palette was a bit dirty so I'm just gonna give it a quick clean and then get back in. Just a very simple ultramarine blue for the sky. Take a bit of the excess water off and then just and then down there, there's going to be some water down there, so just bringing that right down and then I'm going to dry that. And now I'm just going to refix it here on this right hand side where it's stretched. This is uh, one of my favourite places, St Ives. I don't normally do a lot of building, so I'm, I'm sort of learning it myself as I go along. Now, I, did, I did used to use the flat, but I've started using the uh, the height now, even for the buildings and the sharp edges and whatnot. So I'll see how I get on. There's a lot of. I'm going to start off. It's going to be predominantly raw sienna for these roofs. Raw sienna, a bit of ultramarine, and there'll be a bit of Payne's grey in there as well. So, starting off, just sort of plenty of water as well in this. Plenty of water because I want all the colours sort of mixing together. So, one of those few occasions where I've got a bit of water running around on the palette, I don't normally have, but for this. I will. So I'm just sort of very, very loosely putting in the uh, the rooftops. A lot of hit and miss. It's not particularly accurate. But it doesn't really have to be, to be honest with you. Just sort of, I'm just trying to vary the, the strokes and the angles and keep dipping in the water just to make sure I get this variation as I'm going along. See there's a roof. And there'll be a few little windows there. You can pop these windows in there while we're, while we're at it. You see, just a very simple shape of the roof, a few windows and bingo. You got a little house. Maybe a little a few more there and some little windows along here. And we got a big grey one, I'm just going to put in like that. There's a few more down there. And got a sort of down to the walkway now, down the bottom. And Leaving plenty of white bits. That's, you can, that could be like the sun just beaming off the buildings. Yeah, comes down here. 
I was making sure I got plenty of water on the brush. Uh, little gap. Let's put some in this gap there. Another little corner bit. Um, little windows again. Working my way along. Using the very corner of the brush just to slot these little windows and little doors and what have you. And just bring that all the way across, stick another one in there, another roof top. Down there, I'm just putting that straight down. Do my little dips and daps. And the wall sort of works its way around. A lot of it's just sort of abstract detail, just very loosely, just putting the sort of main shapes of what I can see right more than anything else. And Beach down here. And then got the sort of sea in there. Get that sea nice and nice and dark. Because then I can take So 
back a piece of card. I'll just pull this tight first. So I just want it nice and flat to work with. And then take my card. You can just do a few little little boats So it suggests a sort of reflection in there. It's only very loose, remember. And then maybe a few little. Dips and dabs or. Uh, I don't know, just a bit of something just to break up the. Break up the foreground. Now over on the on the shore, just going to put one or two little figures. Just walk it around. Just sort of do a little, just a little dot for a head, and then like a sort of general carrot shape. Really, what I'm working down just gives the impression of someone just rolling around. The one over there. I mean, it could be anything. You know, it's just, just a little bit of detail, just to give people something to think about. I think for now I'll leave it at that. Just make sure that's dry. Put my signature in the corner. And that's another one done. Just a very simple vision of um, St Ives down in the Cornwall. Thanks for watching. Keep practicing, and I'll see you again soon.